Ever hit that snooze button one too many times or dived in your emails before even getting out of bed? Trust me, we've all been there. Today we're delving deep into the top 10 morning habits that might just be getting your day off on the wrong foot. Stick around because understanding and tweaking these habits could transform not just your mornings but your entire day's trajectory. Why? Well, as they say, well begun is half done. Let's make sure we're starting right. Number one, hitting the snooze button. Ah, the ever alluring snooze button. It promises just a few more minutes of rest, but often delivers grogginess and a disrupted sleep pattern. Every time you hit snooze, your body gets tricked into beginning a new sleep cycle it won't have time to complete. Think of it as an unfinished movie. It just leaves you hanging. Additionally, it mentally signals that you're delaying your ambitions for the day, even if it's just momentarily. The fix? Try committing to an earlier bedtime, ensuring you get adequate sleep, and when the alarm rings, embrace the day immediately. Moreover, every interruption to your sleep cycle can decrease the restorative benefits sleep offers. Our bodies go through several sleep phases, and being jolted awake amidst a deep phase can lead to what scientists call sleep inertia. This is that foggy, disoriented feeling that can stick with you for hours. Cultivating discipline in waking up also mentally conditions us for discipline in other areas of our life. It's like a muscle. The more you flex it, the stronger it becomes. Number two, checking your phone. It's become almost instinctual for many, reaching out for the phone right after opening our eyes. But starting the day with emails, social media, or news floods our brains with information, often triggering stress or comparison traps. This practice has been shown to influence our mood and set a reactive tone for the day. So instead of scrolling through screens, take the first moments of the day for something more mindful. Trust me, those emails can wait. Furthermore, the blue light emitted by phones can hinder the production of melatonin, a hormone responsible for regulating sleep. While this might not seem like a big deal in the morning, continuous exposure can affect your sleep quality come nighttime. Starring the day tech-free also reinforces the idea that the morning is your time. Before diving into the world's demands, it's a gentle reminder that you come first. Number three, remaining curled up. If you wake up feeling like the Tin Man from The Wizard of Oz, it's because our spinal discs hydrate while we we sleep, causing stiffness. Rather than staying curled up, indulge in some gentle stretches. Not only does it help with flexibility, but it also boosts circulation, elevates mood, and decreases stress levels. So give your body the wake-up call it deserves. Stretches are more than just a physical act. They can be a ritual that signals to your brain that it's time to start the day. When we combine movement with intention, it becomes a form of self-care. A few minutes of stretching can also provide a moment of introspection, setting intentions for the day, and connecting with oneself. Number four, forgetting to hydrate. While you are asleep, you're not sipping on any water, which means you wake up slightly dehydrated. Drinking water kickstarts your metabolism, aids digestion, supports your immune system, and fuels your brain. And while you might be tempted to go for a cold one, room temperature water is actually easier for the body to process. Morning dehydration isn't just about the hours you spend sleeping, it's about the body process that occurred while you were out cold. Detoxification, cellular repairs, and other vital functions use up our water supply. Hence, that morning glass is like refueling your body's engine. Think of it as your first act of self-love for the day. Number five, drinking coffee first thing. While coffee is the morning elixir for many, your body naturally produces cortisol, a stress hormone in the morning. Drinking coffee during peak cortisol production can lead to increased tolerance, meaning you'll need more over time to get the same wake-up effect. Instead, Consider beginning your day with warm lemon water, which aids digestion and detoxification, and then enjoy your coffee a bit later. If you dive deeper into the science, caffeine actually blocks the brain's adenosine receptors. Adenosine is what makes us feel sleepy, so when it's blocked, we feel awake. But here's the catch. When we continuously flood our system with coffee first thing, our brain starts producing more adenosine. This can lead to increased caffeine dependence and, in the long run, disrupt natural sleep patterns. Number six, leaving your bed unmade. Some say an unmade bed allows it to air out, but there's something about a neatly made bed that instills a sense of order and achievement. It sets a productive tone and is a small gesture that can lead to creating other positive habits throughout the day. Plus, coming home to a tidy bed after a long day is an underrated joy. An interesting study pointed out that individuals who make their beds tend to have better productivity, more robust willpower, and even improved budgeting skills. It's as if this small task creates ripples in other areas of one's life. The act itself also imparts a feeling of accomplishment, offering an early morning win that can boost overall confidence. Number seven, getting ready in the dark. 
Humans are naturally attuned to light. Our internal clocks, or circadian rhythms, are influenced by the presence or absence of light. Getting ready in dim lighting can signal to your body that it's still nighttime, which may hinder waking up fully. So fling open those curtains, soak in the sunlight, and if it's still dark outside, ensure your room is well lit. Sunlight, particularly morning light, has a unique composition. The blue light in it helps reset our internal body clock. This not only assists with waking up, but can also improve the quality of sleep the following night. Introducing light gradually to your morning routine can make the waking process more natural, cueing your body's natural rhythms in sync with the environment. Number 8. Skipping Exercise While not everyone is a fan of dawn workouts, there's undeniable evidence of their benefits. Morning exercise has been linked to increased adherence. You're likely to skip it. Fewer distractions and a significant positive effect on mood and health. You don't need a marathon. Even a brisk walk or short yoga session can work wonders. The psychological effects of morning exercise cannot be overstated. It's a commitment to oneself, an affirmation of prioritizing one's health. Additionally, endorphins released during a workout can set a positive mood trajectory for the entire day. It's like injecting a dose of happiness and motivation, which can be particularly handy on days that demand more from you. Number 9. Rushing After Breakfast Surprisingly, Brushing right after a meal, especially an acidic one, can push the acid deeper into the enamel. This can weaken it over time. A better approach would be to brush your teeth before having breakfast or wait about 30 minutes afterward. It's essential to understand that our mouth's pH drops after eating, especially if you've consumed something acidic or sugary. Brushing during this time can spread this acid, leading to faster enamel erosion. Instead, consider rinsing with water or using mouthwash after meals. This neutralizes the pH, ensuring your tooth brushing doesn't harm but helps. Number 10. Steaming up your shower Hot showers are comforting, but they can make you feel more relaxed, which might not be ideal if you're trying to gear up for a busy day. Cold showers, on the other hand, can be invigorating. They boost circulation, elevate mood through endorphin release, and can even help with muscle recovery. The contrast between hot and cold showers is also worth exploring. While hot showers relax muscles, cold showers stimulate them. Alternating between the two can improve lymphatic drainage and circulation, detoxifying the body more efficiently. If a cold shower seems daunting, even finishing the last 30 seconds with cold water can boost alertness and skin health. A morning routine is personal, and what works for one may not work for another. However, knowing these pitfalls can help you craft a morning that sets a positive, productive tone for the rest of the day. Remember, no morning is perfect. It's about progress, not perfection. And that, Growth Getters, is a wrap for today's video. If you found it valuable, Please drop a like, comment, and subscribe for more informative videos.